quite amazing if we think it's already the eighth year of the Young Wine Writers Competition. It feels like the other day that we started it. And I can truly say, not being a judge, but reading through all the entries every year, they're getting better and better. Which is a good thing, because the judges also make sure that they keep us on our toes to find the best winner and the best runner. This is the, as far as I know, the only South African or really legitimate wine competition, uh, or sorry, wine writing competition, where you know, young wine make, oh, young wine writers can have a voice and and express themselves because you know our industry is comprised not just of winemakers, but it's you know we've got people from you know serv servicing all different facets, you know, from the hospitality side um, to journalism, and I just think it's a wonderful platform for yeah for young people. I consider myself still quite young to so you get their voice out. And that's something that I do in my job, um, it's something I do on the side, it's something I, I, I blog about, I write about, I, I take photographs, so um, I just see myself as you know, helping tell the stories that are in our industry that often aren't told um, through other media. I think we must be grateful that we have youngsters in South Africa, the under 35s, that can now write about wine in South Africa, and hopefully the competition will give them the boot to launch them into the future to become even bigger and better wine writers. And it is up to Wineland Media to promote them and to use the youngsters. The future of our country is not in the hands of the present generation, it's in the hands of the future generation. Cheers.